Hi, welcome to the Mac Laser. Uh, this is Jelly. Today we're going to talk about how to build your own fiber laser cutting machine with CyberCut Control. We will go through three topics. First, who and then why and how. Who can build a laser cutting machine? Mainly if you are a plasma or a flame cutting machine manufacturers. So you are very easy to step into laser cutting business. This is what I've experienced in China. We have many laser cutting machine manufacturers who was doing plasma or flame cutting machine because they, they all cutting sheet metal. Uh, plasma and flame cutting thicker material, laser was cutting very thin material, but with the technology going on, the power goes up. So laser can also cut medium or high thickly sheet metal. So if you are a plasma or a flame cutting machine manufacturers, you've already been aware of the high adjustment of the z-axis and uh, you know how to control the energy to cut sheet metal. You are very easily to step into laser cutting business and you are overlapping in the same customer base. Second category is the sheet metal fabrication machinery dealers or manufacturers. If you are dealing with bending machine, uh, the press brakes or uh, like the um, um, plasma machine or all kinds punching machine, all kinds of sheet metal fabrication machineries means your customer base will need laser cutting machine very much uh, in the future. So you can do laser cutting machine to satisfy your customer requirements. Third, if you are investors from other industries, you know nothing about sheet metal fabrication or laser cutting machine, it's just a fantasy technology, you can also step into this business. We've experienced this in China. Uh, the boss of DNE or HSD, they're not, they're not grown from sheet metal business in China. They are just rich men or they have money and they think that laser cutting technology will have big uh, development in, in the future. So they invest, they have capital, so they can employ technicians or they can build big factories. So these investors are also suitable to grow your own laser cutting business in your country. So this is people who can do laser cutting machines. And why? Why you need to build your own laser cutting machine in your country? First, shipping cost is super high. With the coffee issues uh, coming up in all the countries now, so the shipping a container becomes super, super expensive. Like uh, a 20 inches container from China to Europe is about $10,000. So it's really, really expensive to ship just a frame, a metal structure to your country, which is really a little bit, a little bit um, nonsense. And then time consuming. So if you, if you order a laser cutting machine from China, you need to wait for one or two months manufacturing period, and then you take two months for the sea shipping, then arrive in your customer uh, factory. It costs about half a year, which is really time consuming, and it's a long period, and the laser draws may be dropping price during this period. So it's, uh, it's about very time consuming. And then, uh, if you produce your own laser cutting machines, you can provide better service for your customers because you know how to wear in the laser source to the CNC and uh, to the motors and for all kinds of problems happening, you know what's going on because you debug the machine on your hand and you know how it's functioning for every part of the machine. And the last point, you have more feasibility for the machine configuration because for each country, the local market, because of the situation of the current fabrication basis, you probably have different mainstream for the machine configuration. Maybe they need IVG lasers or maybe they need high power or maybe they are stepping from the entry level. So maybe Richter's laser is more welcome. So this is that you can have more feasibility to configure it your own machine according to your customer need. You can build a high acceleration machine or uh, maybe 0.5G acceleration machine which is necessary for your customer needs. Then you can match 
one kilowatt laser or a six kilowatt laser according to your customer needs. So you have more visibility instead of ordering a machine from a partner in China that maybe they are specialized in certain kind of machines. So this is the visibility that you can have for your customer. You can have the mainframes ready and you can book the lasers later according to your customer needs. So this is why and how. If you are qualified and you are suitable to build a laser cut machine and you know that shipping cost is super high and you want to satisfy your customer at the best timing and the best service, but you don't know how. So today we're going to talk about how to build your own laser cut machine. First, you need the, the mainframe join, which means that how to cut and weld those pipes and sheets together to become a laser cutting machine mainframe, we will, Demoglaser will provide you the join. We have the whole sets of the join for single table, poly exchange, and uh, three quantum five or six by two, all kinds, high acceleration or low acceleration. We can give you the join for free. Of course, you need to buy something from us. It's not totally free. We, we have to survive. So if you buy the laser source or if you buy other things from us, we can provide you the joint. So it's not a problem. You can produce the machine according to this joint. Second, we will provide a complete set of parts for the first machine or the first few machines for you to build in your country. Probably you don't know, you don't know how, how many parts will be needed in building a laser cutting machine, like the motors and the reducers and the rack and pinions and uh, the pneumatic parts and SMC valves and all kinds of very, very detailed things. We will give you a list for a high speed or a medium speed or entry level machine. We will give you the settings, like how much ratios of the reducer and what's the power of the motors and what's the brands and we will give the price reference. So we will give you the complete bone list of a laser cutting machine and we can send to you for the first machine. You can buy locally for the second or the massive production in the future. So no worries about this. And technical support. So if you have, of course you need to have some technicians who know how to wear in groundings or you know, those uh, wearing cabinets things, then we will provide you the schematics like how to connect laser source to control boards and uh, how to wiring everything together to make it functioning. We will give you full video online support. So you will have no problem reading the schematics and to do the wiring with us. So it's uh, no problem. And one stop solution also for fiber laser source problems. You know, many times nowadays we're dealing with many customers or um, partners. They are treating laser cutting machines from other companies or from China and they will have the main problem they cannot solve is the laser source. But if you work with us, you will not have this headache because we will provide you the one-stop solution, including the tools and including uh, all the parts that you need to repair the laser source because the laser source is produced in China. It's very it's very kind of a uh, state of the art and, and it's a little bit mysterious that you don't know how to handle with them. But we will teach you online also step by step that how to repair the lasers. So you have no problem with the machine. Whatever problems happen with the cutting machine, the cutting parameter problems or laser source breakdown or the machine alarms that we will help you to solve all of that. So you will have the best service for your customer. So, as uh, probably with this video, you know that who and why and how to build a laser cutting machine. Do you know what makes this happen so easy? Mm, 10 years before I was working laser cutting business like for 20 years, we would never imagine that as a personal or a private company or maybe a startup, startup business, you're not a giant company or you're a very, uh, very uh, rich experience in machine development. You can never dreaming that you will build a laser cutting machine because it's uh, kind of far from you, like a crown for pistolics or 
they have like 50 years of experience in making this machine. So who make this very simple and possible for everyone that have a little money that you can buy every part and put them together? I think we need to close to CyberCard in China. CyberCard, the name of the company is Friendlies. Friendlies, at least a very good name. But you don't know why they name like this, because it's very friendly for those people that want to use laser cutting machine. And they have cyber cut control from 1000, 2000 C, 2000 S, 3000, 5000, and Canvas 8000, and all kinds of this CNC. And you buy this cyber cut, and you buy a laser source from Rekus or Max or IPG, and you buy a cutting head from Prestec or from Raytools, and you can build them together. It's a very easy job because we will provide you schematics and you just plug them together and it works and it will it will cut like cutting on a butter. So it's a it's because CyberCut he did most of the job of joining everyone together because it's the main brain of a laser cutting machine and it's the heart of the machine and they make the they make everything for you. Because you don't need to consider or develop or to think about it or to, to spend time or money on that how it's working with the height adjustment, uh, the calibration of the nozzle to the, the distance between the nozzle and the sheets and how to positioning, how to find the edges and uh, how to do nesting because CyberCut did everything for you for thinking of the machine and to make acceleration of the machine. And the newest product from CyberCut is 8000 compass control with their cutting head uh, BLT641 and 841 and it's a very very nice cutting head you're gonna love it and it will be the mainstream in the future because because they build the control and they build the cutting head for the laser cutting technology the main difficulty is on the feedback from the cutting effects to the control like how much power I need to give or reduce when I have corners or when I do piercing, how many steps I need to use for high thickness piercing to get faster piercing time and better piercing effects with a small hole. Or during the cutting, I might have plasma effects or I might have them cut through because of the sheet metal is not equal uh, quality or any kinds of these problems, but the cutting head will give a lot of sensors and feedback to the control because it's a canvas, so there is no delay on the signals. So the control will control the cutting head again or the power of the laser. It's all in very microseconds for things. So you will have wholly very good cutting effects on very thin, very thin metal or um, very, you know, 24 hours cutting. You don't need to, like in the, in the past, the operators need to jump on the machine to watch. If it's not cutting through, I need to move the sheet or I need to interface with the cutting head. But with new control, you have no headache with this. You watch everything on the panel and you can, they're working on cloud stuff. You can have ERP, you can have all your tasks pushing from your own, uh, ERP sources to the machine. So it's I mean it's a very I'm proud of I'm proud of CyberCut. It's a it's a company that you know it's like a sharing economy because they provide to many integrators like uh, me or many others and we work with the same control and we have many many problems on each end users with feedback to Shanghai and they correct and they work hard so they do the feedbacks or the improvements or the upgradation of the version to every end users so it's an improvement for thousands or ten thousands of, of customers that is upgrading for, for, for everybody so that makes the building of a laser cutting machine so easy and it's going to be a very good machine so now it's, if you're using uh, that says they're optically. If you buy a laser cutting machine from China, Rekus laser, Max laser, JP laser, or it's a cybercut control, and it's a Rachel's head or a Prestec head, and it's a you know 3.5. I say it has difference, but not really very much difference. 
but you need to pay attention that you spend the money in the best way. Like if you buy a canvas control, you cannot do a very light machine, which is ridiculous because you, you put a BMW motor on a very, very poor uh, car. This is not reasonable. So what you need to do is to buy the right configuration or to build the right configuration with your knowledge about this and or with us together. So we share the same knowledge with you. Um, as a demo laser, our target is to to output all the best or the advanced technology from China. Not only from laser technology, but for all fabrication basis. We keep reporting the most advanced improvements that we've done here in China. We hope that can benefit your manufacturing or your business in your country. So that's all for today. Uh, we will do next period. See you.